Have you ever been curious about the world of sound design and film, but it almost seems like an impossible task? Or maybe you were interested in a career in Foley after hearing the effects of your favorite show. Well, it seems like there is one show in particular that has been making a ton of noise, literally, and that would be the new Netflix series, Squid Game. Not only was the concept of the show innovative, but it had a soundtrack to match that was able to evoke emotion in its watchers. I feel like we should play a similar game based on the sound design of Squid Game, but unfortunately, there is only one surviving participant. Introduce yourself. So what's happening fam, Miami here with JST, and when there's an option to play a Squid Game that's JST inspired, there's no way that I can pass it up, even if it's not the kind of game that I would play. Well, could you use 50 million dollars? Not really, but I could use 50,000 subscribers. Make sure you hit that red button to subscribe, notification bell to be notified when we put up new content, and of course hit that like button if you're enjoying the video. Your transition game really is crazy. Thank you, but I was totally lying before. I could totally use the prize money. I mix pop punk for a living. Say no more. I used to edit for a living. I feel you fam. Well, it's time to hop into this contest. I'm gonna go get ready for that. I'm pretty excited to see what's about to happen. If I'm being real with you, he does not stand a chance. He will be put through the test with a series of games based on recreating sound design from the show you all most likely know me from. Here are the rules. There will be three tests circle, triangle, and square. The challenge must be completed in the time allowed. If it is not, the opponent will be notched out of existence. A player can leave at any time by hitting the red button. Not much different than the one you hit earlier. Haha, <laughs> uh, I guess my transition game is mediocre at best. Test number one, the circle. Recreate the guitar tone from episode one. At the end of episode one, red light, green light. There is an emotive, almost spaghetti western style guitar riff that signifies the loss of the fallen comrades. Let's listen together. Make this full circle by showing us a worthy tone. All right, guys, we don't have a lot of time. My life is literally on the line. Let's check this out. Okay, it sounds like a jazz chorus kind of thing. A little bit, yeah, a little bit of a 5K boot. Some more low end. But that one had modulation. All right. Let's throw, let's see what's going on here. Nah, that one, like I said, more of a jazz chorus. There we go. Last thing, that one's a little bit dirtier, so let's just grab a tube screamer. Do I pass front man? That was a close one, but he managed to pull through. As many of you are guitarists, I'm sure you understand how expressive the instrument can be. It is one of the few instruments that can bring out this level of emotion all by itself. It is now time for test two, the square. Recreate the soldier's theme song with no sound libraries, synths, or samples. Every time this eerie song starts playing, it sends shivers down your spine. Notice I said yours, not mine, as the front man has faced death to the point that he no longer feels it. And that is exactly what this song is associated with. 
the loss of life. And that is exactly what will happen to you should you fail. This test was entitled Square because you are totally boxed in. The timer has been set. All right, so we don't have a lot of time, but let's listen to the main one. We're gonna go a little off axis. All right, now those water drop sounds. Once again, he managed to sneak away with a victory. The thought of using your mouth for the water dropper percussion sound, well, let's just say that was a cheeky move. Using what you have available to you is an important aspect of sound design. Not everyone has a million sound libraries and sound effects packs to choose from, but if you do need one, make sure to check out JST Chaos Production Pack, shameless plug. Sometimes it's good to focus on the one thing that will be most beneficial to getting you from point A to point B, but on to the final challenge. We are on to triangle challenge, number three. Recreate part of a squid game song using only three items. One of the items can be used multiple times or for multiple parts. As a triangle only has three chances to make a point, so do you. If you pass the final challenge, you will be the sole winner of the prize and will live on to see another day. Remember, only three items, and you can do this with any song of your choice. This gives you a bit of flexibility as well as a handicap. May the odds be ever in your favor. It would seem as though you have successfully completed all of the challenges. I did not have any faith in you whatsoever. However, you have defied the odds and become the one and only winner of the Squid Game JST edition. If there is anything to take away from this episode, it's that you have to learn to work with what you have and try to get out of your own way. You can still get the results that your heart desires. If you're an engineer on the come up, give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. You only have to do it one time and tap that bell for notifications so when a video drops, you know the location. Till next time, I'm out of here. Mic drop. Except as engineers we know, I'd never really drop this thing because it'd get really expensive, even if it is a piece of shirt. Later.